the station's in great shape. The crew's uh, in good shape. We've got plenty of work for them to do on orbit and plenty of supplies on orbit to keep them uh, uh, going for quite some time. So while this event is very unfortunate, um, we will support the orbital team as they work through their anomaly and uh, continue to operate station uh, well into the next several months while we wait to, for orbital to uh, return to fly. On behalf of Dave Thompson and the entire orbital team, uh, we do ex want to express our um, disappointment that we were not able to fulfill our obligation to the International Space Station program and to deliver this load of cargo, uh, especially to the researchers who had uh, science on board and the people that were counting on uh, the various uh, uh, hardware and, and components that were going to the station. Um, it began to go wrong around uh, 10 to 12 seconds, I believe. I don't have the exact time. Uh, I do know that uh, range safety initiated the flight termination system uh, around 20 seconds, maybe a little bit before. So most of this happened in the first 20 seconds of flight, and it was fairly quick. It's a tough time to lose a launch vehicle like this and its payload. Uh, it's uh, not as tragic as, as uh, losing a life associated with it, and so we're very happy to report that there were no injuries and the safeguards both in flight and on the ground worked as they should should have and uh, all we lost was hardware. However, something went wrong and we will find out what that is. We will determine the root cause and we will uh, correct that and uh, we will come back and fly here at Wallops again, uh, hopefully in the very near future. But we will do all the things that are necessary to make sure it is as, as safe as we can make it and, uh, and that we do solve the immediate problem of this particular mission.